grace and peace as we have our prayer turned into practice and we're talking about buildings and grounds currently with buildings and grounds i can't help but think of how we extend hospitality or welcome and there's a hymn we often sing about gathered here and gather us in and as we we gather and we extend that hospitality which is i'm going to call it a mandate a mandate of god and without a specific place sometimes it's very difficult to extend that hospitality and with that covid it's a little trickier of course but when you would extend hospitality and certainly in the congregation where i grew up there was always coffee hour and you know they set out donuts or sliced apples or some kind of something but it was extending hospitality and the coffee pot was never ending or the juice boxes and if you came to visit then of course you always receive some kind of card saying we're so glad that you came and please come back so that of course you can go down to coffee hour and have the coffee but it's hospitality so whether we see from the books of genesis on forward it is that warm welcome when you come to visit or if you're a long time long term member that warm welcome is found where everybody knows your name when you walk in the door you can't walk in a door unless of course there's a door and a building buildings and grounds takes care of all of that place and space so that the gracious welcome the hospitality can be offered extended that extension of the love and hospitality the welcome of god there is a place and a space where everybody knows your name or wants to know your name and extend a welcome just as god would amen